Oh, kaiseki is uh, very simple, and then uh, uh, kaiseki means very, very long history in Japan. One kaiseki is a so tea ceremony style kaiseki. Uh, this is uh, my style, and then tea ceremony style is a uh, so one by one small size, and then serving to like a customer. I say like a uh, not a style. Uh, this is uh, so very important in a hospital. Uh, like a hospitality. I introduce like uh, this kaiseki is a very very like a uh, deep things and then I say kaiseki is a uh, still like a uh, question. Generically speaking, there are three different stages. Uh, the three stages are the, the tea ceremony, the flower arrangement, and then the actual cooking element. So this training is basically training your mentality, uh, your visual, uh, all of the different senses. Uh, so not only is it the training of actually you cooking, but it's how you cook, how you appreciate the ingredients, how you put your I would say heart, uh, into the final product. So the flower arrangement, the tea ceremony, and the cooking is also the reflection of the Japanese culture. So if you are able to understand every element, it becomes a lot easier for you to become a kaiseki chef. In Japan, kaiseki chefs do spend about close to 10 years, maybe more, uh, close to a lifetime of training uh, to perfect these elements.